So, <clears throat> so the purpose of this video is because I've got a couple of comments um, saying that we should show how to derive the coefficient correlation uh, correlation coefficient formula that we used in my previous video when we implemented a function for correlation. So, <clears throat> so the formula that I have here is essentially the definition of correlation, which is covariance of x and y divided by the standard deviation of x and standard deviation of y. So this is the definition that we all see in most of the textbooks mm, that we came across. And generally the meaning of correlation is um, how linearly is your x related to y, right? So let's see how to derive or reduce um, correlation formula that we see here. So by by definition we know that covariance of x and y can be written as sigma x minus x bar xi minus x bar times yi minus y bar by n minus 1. So what we have here is a sample co covariance, right? Now, <clears throat> if I actually use this in my correlation coefficient formula, rho is equal to sigma xi minus x bar times yi minus y bar by n minus 1 sigma x and sigma y, right? The reason I split it out is because you'll see that in a moment. So what I can do is I can take this particular expression, let me change the color, as zx, right? And this particular expression as zy. Because what you can see here is actually, this is the formula that we use to standardize any series, right? So we can basically rewrite this as rho is equal to sigma zx and zy by n minus 1. So this is exactly what you saw in my previous video where I used this formula to implement my correlation coefficient function. You can use other formulas as well, but this is a little more intuitive and a little more easier to understand. So thank you very much. Please do look for my Python video on how to implement the correlation function on Python and um, how to derive correlation between two variables in a data frame. Thank you.